So real quickly while I have you guys, I'm just gonna do a real quick mini review on the Circle, Netflix's new TV series, reality series type show. I don't know really what to call it. Can I see Alana's profile? I'm a full-time model. No. If you like Big Brother, um, which I'm a fan of, I, well, okay, not a fan. Fan is a stretch. Um, I grew up watching Big Brother. I kind of stopped watching it until they got the celebrity Big Brother. Then I started watching those only. But if you like Big Brother, it's pretty much just like that as far as uh, Netflix series. They're only releasing, I think, this in four episodes and is really only going to last to the end of January. But what's unique about this is that the individuals actually live in separate apartment complexes all in the same building. They can't see each other, they can't hear each other, but they can communicate through this sort of voice activated TV functionality called the circle. And what's really cool about this is the fact that you can start up private chats with people and also you get to make up your profile. Now, some folks have sought out to be catfishes. If you know what the term catfish is, it's when someone is portraying uh, an identity online that is not themselves. So if I was portraying like a Sarah with blonde hair, that's I'm not Sarah with blonde hair. Um, so you would understand that some folks are doing that and some folks in the show believe some others are catfish and they do these little weird challenges every single episode, like little games and stuff. And then they kind of come down to everybody in the circle voting who or they rank the other players and that is who gets initially assigned like the top person and then they vote out somebody. So I'm interested to see how this series goes overall. Um, I can't help but get the vibe that this is sort of setting up like a Black Mirror twist episode thing that Netflix got and we didn't all see it coming in the end. It's going to be some weird, scary stuff because I keep thinking this is sort of like going to just end in some kind of weird creepy way but um can't help that with black mirror you never know what's going around the corner but anyway that is my thoughts on the uh circle i'm enjoying it i find a little some of the characters to be a little bit annoying but if you grew up watching big brother or the real world or any of those kind of reality shows it's very in tune with that i think netflix has sort of a hit on their hands uh if they did another season i would like to have something more interactive maybe some way we can chat with them maybe some kind of way where it's a stream 24 7 and anytime you pop onto netflix you can just watch the different rooms or something to that degree would be kind of cool um, I think that would be some really cool technology. It would keep people invested, especially going back to Netflix and you can live stream and chat and stuff. Maybe some kind of chat feature that you can do with your friends while you're watching it. That would be kind of cool, but uh, we'll see how that goes for season two down the line if they have another season. But that is my uh, little mini review on uh, Netflix's The Circle.